Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. Our summertime fine fitness week is in full swing. And, and because our cycling series almost took quad out, <laughs> and Rashawn, well really Rashawn was laughing yesterday. I decided to slow things down and get a good stretch in with a relaxing yoga session. And of course, I have my sisters joining me. Yay, and they're so beautiful and pretty Yay. and we're all in black, you know, because we have to match. Um, but, you know, we always do floor. You know, we always do floor postures, we're on the floor. So today I wanted to, you know, give you guys some standing postures that you can do at home that are very simple. You wanna do these postures for 30, 20 to 30 seconds each. So we're gonna, just gonna start with a Tadasana. Tadasana is mountain pose. Mountain pose allows you to open up your diaphragm. It's good for breathing. It strengthens the knees, the thighs, and the ankles. And you really can just stand like this at home watching TV. Just breathing deeply in and out through the nose, box breathing in through the nose, out through the mouth. One more time, ladies, in through the nose, out through the mouth. Now we're gonna get right into our postures. The first posture is pretty simple, you might have heard of it. It's called Warrior One. So we're gonna open our legs, we're not gonna do shoulder width, we're gonna do a little bit of shoulder width, so put your arms out like this. You want your ankles to be in alignment with your wrists. Okay, so we're gonna turn our, we're gonna keep our right foot straight, and we're gonna turn our left foot out. Left foot out, but you wanna keep your hips squared, hips squared. Now you take your arms without turning your back foot, and just swing into warrior one, and bend your left knee. And you want to get, so you don't, you don't want to have your knee overextend your toe quad. Oh, That's what right, so you just want to, you want to bounce your knee and get a 90 degree angle right here and you keep your arms Hold up. on, let me squat down uh -huh, a little bit. Uh -huh. <laughs> let me come on over there and help you out. Yeah. <laughs> Why does everybody have to help me? <laughs> <laughs> Warrior ones. So what are some of the benefits of this pose, this posture? This posture is a good stretch for your hips, for your thighs, your hamstrings, your shoulders, your I calves, can't my calf muscles. your navels, yes, honey, your lungs. It's got it all going on. Your thorax, okay? <laughs> warrior one. Nice. So now from warrior one, we're just gonna go into warrior two, which is gonna come straight back, straight back into the front, your arms straight down like this. You're gonna keep this foot turned in. Warrior two. Now this also stretches the thorax, the lungs. Um, your ankles, your shoulders, your legs, and it's great, it's a great hip opener. You wanna try to get this leg down as, as low as you can. 90 degree angle if you can. If you can't, that's fine too. Don't push it, because you don't wanna tear anything. Mm -hmm. I know, that's right. Okay, girl. <laughs> mm. Okay. You can feel that all in your hip too. Well, yes, and in the, in, the, in the thighs too. Yes, in the thighs. something's going on with me right here. That's the, You got it all going <laughs> on, that means here. you're doing something right. Now you just want to reverse into reverse warrior and just kind of tilt. And now you're getting a stretch right Ooh, along your obliques. Yes, that feels right. Okay nice. then, inner thighs, hips, quadriceps. That leg is getting tired Ain't it something? <laughs> And it's up. Now come back to warrior two. And just bring your legs in. Come back to the middle of your mats. And bring your arms down. Come back to Tadasana. Breathe in through the nose, out through the mouth. Now we're going to go into a chair sequence. This is really good for your quadriceps. So keep your feet together, heels and toes touching. And just bend down like you're going to sit down on a chair that's invisible, that is not there. And then raise your arms up. Palms facing each other. And relax your shoulders down. Press your heels into the floor. Chest is lifted, chin is level. And just breathe. This is a good stretch for your quadriceps, your it. ankles, <laughs> child, your thighs. And the back, it seems Ooh, like something going on with the, the lower back. Tell me when I tell you the lower back. <laughs> yes. Should the lower back be flat or arched? The That's lower back should be flat. Okay. Ooh, my eyes is kind of arched. Hold and, on. And, and always <laughs> keep your stomach tucked in. Always hold your stomach in. Now, bring your hands into prayer position slowly. In the middle of your chest, you want to relax your shoulders down and slowly twist to the right for an inverted chair or spinal twist. You want to try to get your left elbow on the right side of your right knee. And if you can, keep your hands in prayer in the middle of your chest. If not, that's fine. What you don't want is your hips to dance all over the place. You want to keep them straight and just breathe. Back to the center slowly. And the other side. It's 
It's a good stretch in your spine, my God. Just breathe. And come back to the center. Release your arms back up. And slowly come back up. And bring your arms down. Breathe in through the nose, back to Tadasana. Out through the mouth. Now last two postures, ladies, this is gonna get a little hard. Oh, this boy. is hand to toe pose. Now you do your best. You're gonna bring your foot up. You don't wanna go down, cause you wanna hurt your back. Bring your foot to you. Grab your big toe with these two fingers, index fingers, and stretch your foot forward. Oh Lord, why we gotta do all well, that? I'm gonna do the alternate yeah, version. Now, now, alternate, wherever you can go, right here. Up. This is fine too, right here. Let me see if I can do it. We'll just do one side for the people. But here is good. Here is good wherever you can go. Is that the alternate tree? <laughs> Look at me. And that's the alternate. And release. <laughs> last posture, last posture. Just, just to be pretty with it. It's okay. called the dancer pose. Okay. Now we can all do this, I think. I think. You're going to grab, bend your right knee. Grab your foot from the front. Like this. Old school, old school stretch. Raise your left hand. You can make it fancy doing this. A lot of people do this or not. And just slowly kick your foot back. Hold on, wait a minute. Keep your chest lifted. <laughs> this is called Lord of the Dance. All right, girl, I'm gone. I'm done. Great job, ladies. Lord of the Tramps, I'm not doing that. I hope everybody watching at home feels a bit more limber and relaxed. We'll be right back.